केमिकल प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ अमोनिया गैस आई वॉन्ट टू मेन्सन सम ऑफ द केमिकल प्रॉपर्टीज ऑल ऑफ वी नो दैट केमिकल प्रॉपर्टी ऑलवेज कम्स विथ द केमिकल रिएक्शन दस वे लिस स्टार्ट विथ केमिकल रिएक्शन नंबर वन हाइड्रोजन क्लोराइड गैस रिएक्ट विथ अमोनिया टू फॉर्म अमोनियम क्लोराइड विच एपियर्स इन द फॉर्म ऑफ सोलिड पार्टिकल्स जस्ट लाइक दिस अमोनिया एन एस थ्री इट्स मॉलिकुलर फॉर्मूला वेन इट रिएक्ट विथ हाइड्रोजन क्लोराइड गैस इट कैन बी सोन लाइक दिस ऑल्सो लेस से वी हैव अ गैस आर हि and another gas jar also let's see and these two gas jar are filled with two different compounds one is filled with let's say ammonia ammonia this gas and another is filled with hydrogen chloride gas now they are separated by means of uh, glass lid and if we pull this glass lid then what happens ammonia is light gas uh, but hydrogen chloride is heavier than ammonia that's why hydrogen chloride comes down and ammonia goes up and hydrogen chloride and ammonia they react with each other to form ammonium chloride like this and this ammonium chloride is solid white solid and that's why uh, the whole uh, gas jar uh, is found to be filled with white solid particles which like looks like fume and this fume is made up of what ammonium chloride that's why what can we say ammonia reacts with ammonia gas reacts with hydrogen chloride gas to form ammonium chloride which appears in the form of white fume it is made up of minute uh, ammonium chloride particles this is one of the chemical property of ammonia now let's talk about second one it reacts with acid to form salt what ammonia reacts with acid let's take one of the acid sulfuric acid it reacts with acid to form salt when these two reacts with each other then a salt forms which is ammonium sulfate ammonium valency 1 sulfate 2 that's why i'm writing here 2 this reaction represents that ammonia gas reacts with sulfuric acid to form a salt called ammonium sulfate we can uh, give other example also ammonia when reacts with hydrogen chloride i mean to say hydrochloric acid then it forms ammonium chloride in the same way nitric acid they they form salt this is another important chemical property of ammonia now let's talk about another one ammonia dissolves in water to form weak alkali called ammonium hydroxide it can be represented by chemical uh, reaction ammonia dissolves in water like this they react with each other to form ammonium hydroxide and this is a weak alkali okay. uh, this reaction represents that uh, this statement okay now we can write another also ammonia dissolves in water to form ammonium hydroxide which reacts with acid to form neutral compound salt and water ammonia dissolves in water to form ammonium hydroxide first i told this ammonium hydroxide and when ammonium hydroxide this weak alkali reacts with acid like sulfuric acid when ammonium hydroxide like uh, nh4oh when reacts with hydrochloric acid then if it reacts with nitric acid the weak alkali ammonium hydroxide when reacts with acid they form what this acid base reaction and acid base reaction always gives salt and water and hydrogen of the acid is displaced by the uh, ammonium part and that's why ammonium sulfate nso4 hold to so4 ammonium sulfate and water we can balance this equation salt and water by taking here to 
and you also to uh, ammonium hydroxide when reacts with hydrochloric acid then what forms ammonium chloride forms this is salt and another product is water acid when reacts with base salt and water forms here what happens ammonium nitrate forms ammonium nitrate and another product is water that's why what is uh, the statement for this these reactions it dissolves in water to form ammonium hydroxide which reacts with acid to form neutral compound salt and water okay now let's talk about another one fifth one a nitrogenous fertilizer probably you have heard about this urea this is a nitrogenous fertilizer a nitrogenous fertilizer urea is prepared by reacting ammonia with carbon dioxide ammonia when reacts with carbon dioxide gas then what happens this urea forms this is uh, this reaction takes place at 1500 degree celsius temperature and uh, when they react with each other then what happens they form uh, this uh, uh, urea and urea is formula can be written like this ns2 uh, bone co bone ns2 we can write normally like this also n s2 whole 2 co also we can write like this also this is what urea and along with this water also form this is ammonia reacts with carbon dioxide gas at the temperature of about 1500 degree celsius to form urea this is urea which is one of the important nitrogenous fertilizer used in field okay now next let's talk about another chemical property ammonia reacts with oxygen to form nitrogen gas ammonia when it reacts with oxygen then what forms nitrogen gas forms not only nitrogen gas but along with nitrogen water also forms now how to balance this equation hydrogen 2 here 3 uh, this odd number if we take here 2 then it becomes even number uh, now 3 2 just 6 and if we take here 3 then it becomes uh, if 3 2 just 6 then uh, 3 oxygen it makes uh, it becomes a di little difficult that's why it would be better to have 6 6 2 the 12 and if we take here 6 then it will be better to have here 4 4 3 the 12 6 2 the 12 okay now problem is solved nitrogen 2 if we take here 2 then and this is also balanced this way ammonia reacts with oxygen to form what nitrogen nitrogen gas along with water and these are the major chemical properties of ammonia gas okay this was for today